Hey guys, it's Lala and welcome back to my channel. So if you're new, I wanna say welcome. I'm so glad that you decided to click this video and hang out with me for a little while. If you're returning, welcome back. And as you can see by the title, this is a Dollar Tree haul. I am really excited to share the things that I found. There are lots of new items, Christmas items. I'm just thrilled. The other thing I wanna say is, if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead, hit that subscribe button down below. Become part of my friends and family here on YouTube. We are getting closer to 10,000, which is gonna be amazing, so I can do a 10,000 subscriber giveaway. It's gonna be awesome. So if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do that. And if go ahead and click that bell. If you haven't already, you'll get notifications of every time I upload a video. And don't forget to check out my Instagram. It's always in the description box below. Without further ado, into the haul we go. The number one thing that was on my wish list were the Christmas rugs. So I found the North Pole one. So, so gorgeous. Definitely looks like it costs more than a dollar. You could layer um, a different um, design on the back, like a buffalo check or a plaid or flannel, something like that to make it look more expensive. So excited to find that one. And then of course I found the red truck. What? kind of Christmas would I have without the red truck. So I like to use these. Um, I usually use these in my kitchen and I'll also, um, with the Halloween one that I got that said trick or treat, I actually put that over my doormat that was already there and it worked perfect. So um, you can use these on like in the outside, but I would suggest it be obviously somewhere that's covered, you know, on my front porch it's covered. So it's not really getting rained on or anything like that. But Definitely uh, a great deal for a dollar. I guess I'll keep with my Christmas. I guess I'll keep all my Christmas stuff together to show you that. So the next thing I found, and I don't think I've seen anyone haul these, and I was really excited to find them, were these stockings here with the with the monogram letters on them. So I have buffalo check ones that I got from Family Dollar um, with fur for Greg and I, but for my boys, my fur babies. Um, I did get each of them a stocking. So we have A for Axel, B for Billy, and it was the last A and the last B that my store had. Um, and they and the stores may very well restock by the time, you know, it's still kind of early. They could restock on certain things, um, but I wanted to go ahead and grab them now. So he, look, don't count on Dollar Tree restocking. If you see something and you want it, I know some people don't like to celebrate Christmas, you know, early. They don't like to, you know, maybe decorate too early or buy things for it, but if you are new to shopping at Dollar Tree um, or newer, you don't go there as often, please heed my advice that if you see something that you, you really want, grab it now because there is a chance they may not have it. So that's why I did go ahead and grab each of the stockings. Probably should have grabbed more of these, but I went ahead and only grabbed two for now. I'm hoping to use these at our Christmas party um, in December when we have it here. And it's the Peppermint Candy Cup. That's what they're calling it. It is a peppermint uh, shot glass is what it looks like to me. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and open one of them to show you. The cashier at Dollar Tree said that she used these at a get together of hers one time and the only issue she had was that it was a little sticky. So I'm gonna take it out and it is essentially I don't want to take it out of the plastic because I don't want to touch the peppermint yet, but it is just a shot glass. That's what it really is. And I think how festive will that be to um, take shots and to have at our Christmas party. So I did grab two of them. And again, I, I probably will go back and get more. And there's even nutrition facts on there if you need to see them. But it does, um, says peppermint candy cup, lick it, refill it, and eat it. I'm just gonna grab random things. The next thing is this Russell Stover Peppermint. They had this last year. This comes out at the Dollar Tree around every Christmas. I want to insert here and say sorry about the lighting, but it's not great. Um, as soon as I sat down to film, it started to rain. So doing the best I can with the lighting. Um, but it is Peppermint Russell Stovers, and it's the crushed peppermint pieces and white fudge. These are so so good. Um, I used to get these um, when we worked in the office and you know, like every day I'd put like a little tree on the, and on everyone's little desk on my team, but um, we're not in the office now. So I just bought these probably to put in a candy dish here, eat myself. I don't know, but I just bought them because they're good. These also make great stocking stuffers. Keeping in line with the Christmas foods, I saw this bag of these sweet 
Chaos. And it says it's um, Sweet Chaos Homemade Kettle Corn Peppermint Crunch. So it's got all sorts of stuff in it. It says it's made with cane sugar and sea salt. No high, fruit no high fructose corn syrup, so that's good. It's certified gluten-free, non-GMO popcorn. It's popped in coconut oil, so that's always good. And it's, drizzle it's drizzled peppermint crunch. <clears throat> I cannot talk today. It is peppermint crunch drizzled with sweet, white, and dark icing. So, I bought this for me, and I cannot wait to give it a try. Okay, so my best friend loves cats, and so I had to get this for her. And it's this is this will be her Christmas card. And it says, Meowie and Bright. I just thought it was so cute. Dollar Tree obviously has their regular like Christmas cards, like their Hallmark and all of that. But this is part of their handmade Christmas cards, and they had the whole display up. And they are so adorable. And inside, inside of the card, it looks like this. And it says, wishing you the kind of Christmas that puts joy in your heart. Merry Christmas. And it's really cute. And it is by the Walla brand. And I don't know if you can tell, but the little Chris Santa hats that the cats are wearing are like 3D. So cute. So the next thing I've seen so many people haul, and my store had a few of them left. And it is this tumbler. Hard to see because it is like this beautiful iridescent, but it does say Merry and Bright on it. And it's got this slide. The top, it has like this slide feature. So it will stay pretty secure. And depending on how the light hits it, you know, it's iridescent. So it changes to blue to purple to pink. And it's just absolutely beautiful. And I had to pick it up. Next thing I had to pick up, I think I mentioned it in my last haul, but I had to pick up the Buffalo Check headband. I did not want them to sell out of them, and I knew I needed this for Christmas to match Greg's Buffalo Check Santa hat that I got him. And guys, these are just so cute. Cannot wait to put these okay, on. Okay, so I had not seen these before, and I thought, well, for our Christmas party, if you didn't watch, um, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I think it was in my vlog though too, um, I had video, if I, if I remember correctly, of Greg's um, balloons we did for his birthday that were from the Dollar Tree. And they're these balloons that you blow up with a stick. And this one says Mary, and it's in red. And this one said Christmas. And I believe they had Mary they had Mary in green and red, and they had Christmas in also green and red. But I wanted them to be different colors when they were next to each other. So I did pick up the Merry Christmas it's super easy. You just stick the straw on it and you blow it up. They last. They are great quality for just a dollar. Um, the size of these is um, the the Mary balloon is 26 inches by 13 inches. And the Christmas balloon is 28 inches by 11 inches. And it says they are solid color. They both come with the sealing. They both include the self-sealing valve. Um, it has a six inch plastic straw and it has a seven inch ribbon. So if you wanted to hang it, you could because it does also include the ribbon. I'm so excited to find these. I remember they had these last year, but I could not find them. And these are the candy cane spoons. And I thought these are perfect for the hot cocoa bar that I want to have at our Christmas party. And it does say here on them that they are individually wrapped. And these would be great for um, stocking stuffers. You could put these in a gift basket that you were making. I mean, you can do so much with them. And the fact that they're individually wrapped makes them great to take each one and make like little individual. You could do a mug with a hot cocoa packet and one of the spoons and it would just be the cutest little gift for a teacher or a coworker. And so I grabbed here and you do get six of them in here. And I believe I, they did not have these last year now they also have the chocolate spoons and these they're calling stirring spoons and it says that they melt obviously while you are um stirring your hot chocolate or whatever you're going to stir with them um they are made by palmers you can see that's who they're made by some people like the palmers chocolate some people don't so that is who the chocolate is made by palmers is not my absolute favorite but i think mixed into some hot cocoa it would be fine last christmas item i have are these christmas cards and they are absolutely stunning and you do get 12 of them in here with white envelopes and this is what the front 
of the Christmas cards look like. They are beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. They do have the um, buffalo check or plaid Christmas mm -hmm. truck, the tree, and the background, I don't know if you can tell, it has like um, sheet music on it. And I just think it's absolutely beautiful. And it says Merry Christmas. And on the back, it tells you what it says on the inside. And it says best wishes for a wonderful holiday that brings fond memories to last a lifetime. And you do get 12 of them with the white envelopes. All right. So I believe that's everything for Christmas. So everything else is not Christmas. And I'm going to start with, I'm just going to grab random things. So the first thing I have are made by Crayola. And these are the washable take note felt tip pins. I love felt tip pins. They also have the same ones in gel, um, but this one is a pink and a red. It's a, obviously a two pack. And then I also got them in the purple and green. These are the only colors that I saw in the, um, in the felt tip, but I believe they had other colors for the gel pins as well, but I took pictures and it's on my Instagram. Um, I got this for a DIY I'm gonna try. It's just a cookie sheet. I also grabbed this hairspray because I wanted to try it, and it's the Salon Selective's Flexible Hairspray, so I don't know much about it. This one says it's got brushable control hold, hair plumping, anti-humidity, non-sticky formula. All of that sounded good to me for a dollar for four ounces. When I curl my hair, um, I have a lot of hair, but it's very fine. And um, when I curl my hair with a curling iron, sometimes the curls don't hold as well as I would like. So um, I just wanted to try a new um, hair. I bought this next item for when I finally get a chance to redecorate <clears throat> And really put my office together I want to use this in there I had a theme I was going for I've changed that so anyways this is it's so beautiful it's a tea light holder and it has like that oil slick look to it I'm just spinning it to show you it looks the same everywhere on the inside it's just this plain like silver color but it's absolutely stunning. Greg thought it was a wine glass. It's not, it is a candle holder, but it's beautiful. And you could use it for a wine glass if you want. Who's gonna tell you? you I'm excited to find this. Um, this is by Hanes. This is a Hanes brand. And this is a t-shirt. It says t-shirt, large adult, but it's a long sleeve, if you can see that. It's a long sleeve t-shirt. I know the black is not showing up great, but it is a long sleeve Hanes t-shirt and um, I don't know I don't know if I'm gonna keep it for myself my intention is to see if it fits Greg I haven't had him try it on yet to see if it fits Greg um, because I want to get a Pittsburgh Steeler like iron-on decal and put it on his shirt or um, maybe use the vinyl with my Cricut and make him a long sleeve Pittsburgh Steelers shirt because he doesn't have one. He won't buy them. He'll just wear t-shirts. So I figured if I made him one, he would I'm wear excited one. to find these socks. These are name brand socks. Um, I'm sure most of you guys um, know this brand and it's the Mossy Oak brand. And uh, they had, so you get two pair and they had a set of two pairs of black, a set of two pairs of white, a black and a white set, and they also have black and gray. So I got the, this is the women's, sock size nine to 11, shoe size four to 10, and they are the Mossy Oak Dry Fresh Moisture Wicking Socks. And again, you get two pair, and they are the um, like ankle socks. So I picked up those, and then I also picked up the pair that has the gray and the black. So you cannot beat Mossy Oak socks for a buck. This has been on my wish list since I saw Vivian Tries. If you don't watch her channel, she's hilarious. She tries different products from stores, as seen on TV. Definitely check her out here on YouTube. Um, but I saw her show this and um, Greg got me AirPods for my birthday. And I saw this, it's an earphone case. And I saw her put her um, AirPods in it and it fit perfectly. I don't have my AirPods in here with me right now, but I will open it up and show it to you. Okay, so I got a little closer to the camera. So it comes with this, uh, like, what are they called, carabingers? So it came with one of those. And it looks like this, and it is like a silicone. And you can see the slit on the back, it'll go, and it, it comes off. So your AirPods go in here, and then that will stay on. And once it gets a good suction, it'll flip back for your AirPods to go in here. Um, if I remember, I'll put a little clip in 
um, of showing you all with my AirPods, but this is so cute. And of course I had to get the unicorn, but they did have other designs. I believe they had a cat, a panda bear, I don't remember what else, but I did take pictures and it is on my Instagram. You guys have seen me repurchase these multiple times. My dogs love these. Every time I go to Dollar Tree, I grab a bag so they never run out. And these are the dog treats. And of course, Axel looked right at me when I said I thought it. this would just be good to have. It's by Bonnie Bar, so it's not a Dollar Tree product. It's a two-in-one bottle opener and can punch. So it looks like this. And you can use it as a bottle opener or a can punch. My my goal is to put this in our hurricane kit. Um, I believe the bottle opener, we do have a bottle opener um, on our can opener that's in our drawer already. But I wanted to have one for our hurricane kit. So I did pick this up for that reason. It's so cute. It just looks really nice. And I had to pick it up. It does still have plastic wrap on it. So I'm going to try not to have it glare. But it's this new picture frame. And you can see it here and it is a four by six and I love the gold with the white like the kind of matte like matting is that what they call that I don't know but anyways that's just it's just a beautiful picture frame and I hadn't seen this one at my store before it says wall mount or easel back and that is true it does have the easel back here or it does have the mount and it is a glass pane that's in there so it's just super cute okay my last few items are food items and I'll show you those pretty quickly so I got myself this and this is a dill pickle in a pouch little fact about me if you're new or didn't know I love pickles my favorite are claws and pickles but I love pickles especially like these bigger pickles that come in the pouches I like to put them in the refrigerator and let them get really cold they just remind me of the pickles you used to get in like elementary school when you would buy them for like 60 cents I just love these it's a new item and I'm excited to make this probably around the holiday time and it's by Betty Crocker and it's the brittle mix and it's brownie brittle mix and it says ready in three easy steps who doesn't like easy stuff I'm not a baker so basically it says you'll need um, one stick or half a cup of butter softened not melted that's it like that's it I cannot wait to give it a try hey guys these food items I was super I was thrilled to find these these are full-size items name brand for a dollar um, the first one it is by Betty Crocker and it's called chilled treats and it's the French vanilla mousse and you do get four of them it says four individual servings it's French vanilla mousse with salted caramel toppings so you do get four of them it had that flavor and then the other flavor they had was the chocolate mousse with chocolate ganache topping i think these are a great deal for a freaking dollar but not least it's not as exciting but i actually hadn't tried these and i wanted to so it's nice to get the two pack of the cheese it snapped and this is in the flavor cheddar and sour cream and onion and it's they are 1.5 ounce bags so uh, I'm gonna give them a try see if I like them sometimes I want like a crunchy chip so give them a shot that is my Dollar Tree haul for this week I hope that you guys enjoyed it um I think I got some really great stuff I love all the Christmas stuff that I found I'm actually this evening Greg is gonna be taking Christmas stuff out of the attic and tomorrow night I am gonna start decorating for Christmas I know it's early but I do have a surgery coming up on the 20th of this month it's gonna put me down for about 10 days or so so I want to be able to um, have the stuff at least out of the attic and get a little bit done here and there so if you'd be interested in seeing like a decorate with me type video make sure you comment down below and let me know comment down below and let me know what items you guys are on the hunt for i love to chat with you guys in the comments if you're new and didn't know that yes i rep i try to reply to all of my comments i love talking with y'all and that's it for this week's haul like i said i hope that you guys enjoyed it subscribe if you have not it really does help my channel and um, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up that also shows that you're engaging and it shows me the content that you guys like so it helps me and the channel and again it would be appreciated you guys know how much I appreciate all y'all's love and support it means the world to me and that's it so I will see you guys in my next video bye